Welcome to Data News in Malaysia. Let's be clear, the so-called golden era of relations with China is over, British Prime Minister Rishi Sunak said in his speech on Monday. In response, a spokesman for the Chinese embassy in the UK said that the British side's statement was full of ideological prejudice and that the root cause of the UK's difficulties lay in itself and that China should not be blamed without grounds. While Trust called China a threat during her term of office, Sonak has changed it to a systematic challenge. But the vicious slander against China has not changed. The British economy is recovering at the bottom of the G7, and Conservative Party MPS do not see any political achievement, but only advocate anti-China stance. It is widely believed that, in the face of intensifying domestic problems and calls for a general election, Sonak's primary purpose is to win the support of anti-Chinese members in an attempt to retain his position as the country's prime minister. Such an attitude will only lead to the intensification of party divisions and the stagnation of the British economy. Britain is no longer an empire on which the sun never set. It possibly suggests UK should realize that the root of its dilemma originates from itself and seeks to strengthen international cooperation to make progress together actively.